Hello, my name is Leslie. I've lived in Shanghai for over 15 years, and I've been a part-time TEFL trainer for the last 10 years. Despite my previous teaching experience, I decided to raise my training skills to a higher, more professional level. So I sought out a reputable training company that could offer a set of online training courses that utilizes a systematic learning approach. I got really lucky when another TEFL trainer introduced me to this company, ITTT, the International TEFL and TESOL Training Company, and highly recommended that I try one of their courses. I've appreciated their courses so much that I just completed my second course. I first completed their foundation 120-hour online TEFL course in which I learned valuable teaching skills and was presented with terrific teaching resources, many of which I have come to use as my go-to materials for many of my lesson plans. In fact, I want to share with you some of the many other reasons why I found the classes in this course invaluable. For example, this course presented a solid and comprehensive review of all English's major verb tenses. And for each different verb tense, the course provides grammar rules, sentence patterns, suggestions on how to teach the verb tense, and many examples to help teach the teacher to be very clear themselves, which is really important when trying to teach our students. Another very valuable concept that I learned from this course was a well-accepted approach to structuring classes according to the ESA approach, or elicitation, study, and activate. After learning about this concept, I realized that almost all English training books and materials are structured around this concept and how valuable this excellent approach was to improving my own teaching ability. I also learned many important tips and tricks to class and lesson management, which has guided me in conducting much smoother and well-controlled classes. Furthermore, this course also introduced me to the practice of preparing detailed lesson plans, offered many suggestions, and even provided many lesson plan templates and examples. Also very useful was a study of good versus bad teacher habits and qualities that are introduced via some video case studies. Two other specific lessons which really helped me to be more of a professional teacher included the material on phonetics and pronunciation and the lesson on conditionals. Interestingly, many of these topics seem to come naturally to the native speaker like me. That is, I don't really remember learning these skills or grammar when I was a young student, but as a teacher, I really need to deeply understand these concepts so that I can easily and clearly teach them to my students. All in all, I can't recommend enough this basic course to anyone thinking about becoming a TEFL teacher or teachers with some basic experience or even teachers like myself who already have a solid foundation of several years teaching experience. After completing that first 120 our basic course, I realized that since I'm getting more and more involved in training young learners, there was much more that I needed to learn to continue to raise my professional abilities to the next level for teaching children. So I decided to enroll in their 50 hour TEFL to young learner course. Similar to the many valuable lessons I learned from the first course, this extra course was certainly no letdown. In its brief six units, I also gained so much excellent information that is specifically focused on teaching young learners, which I now routinely use in each of my children's classes. For example, this course shared lots and lots of very useful English teaching materials that I have now eagerly incorporated into my lesson plans. The course also introduced me to more specific problems and solutions to classroom management of young learners which is obviously quite different than the classroom of adult learners. Complementary to the material on developing lesson plans in the previous course, this course focuses on planning lessons for young learners, even separates the ideas into different age groups. Because as I learned in this class, so many aspects of teaching kids vary 
depending on their age groups. For example, the way to teach to seven-year-olds should be quite different from teaching to 12-year-old kids. One last important aspect of this course that I found so useful was the focus on using and varying different teaching themes in each class to maintain interest and excitement in the young students to continue to pay attention and engagement in the class. Now that I've completed this class, I realize what an excellent decision that was. In summary, I have personally seen obvious improvement in my teaching ability to both adults and young learners after completing these courses and applying what I've learned in the classroom and lesson plans. I can't recommend ITTT's online classes enough. I'm sure that you will too find them enormous value in your classes. And now I'm just trying to make the difficult choice about which of ITTT's many classes I'll register for next. Thanks so much for watching. We are ITTT, the leading provider for TEFL and TESOL training courses. If you like this video, please subscribe by clicking the button down here and click on any of the videos here on the left for more interesting teaching tips for getting certified to teach English abroad and online.